to the Pacific Point Marine Conservation Center. My name is Dr. Zalopis, and all of us here are so excited. You will be joining us to hear all about the wonderful things happening at Pacific Point Preserve right next door. On today's agenda, you'll hear all about the conservation efforts of the animals here in our care, thank you, who do play an active role and we consider them to be partners with us. But more on that in just a little bit. Right now, I would love to introduce to you one of the California sea lions that calls this preserve its home. It's Seymour! of North America. They can range in size from a couple of hundred to nearly 1,000 pounds. Now, we will be seeing a lot more of Seymour later on in the day. Uh, for right now, though, I'm supposed to be joined by this new intern. Now, Wait, I'm here! I'm coming! So Neutron, Neutron, since you are new, just don't touch anything. <laughs> yeah, you got it, Dr. Zucchini. <laughs> Guys, I cannot believe she's putting me in charge of this plan on my first day. I am so excited. It looks like we're going to do some pretty cool things today. I bet you guys are wondering what we're doing, right? Yeah? Okay. First thing on the list, meeting the doctor, which we already did. And then it looks like the next thing we're going to do is do some pretty cool animals. What and was that noise? I told you not to touch anything. Um, well, aren't 
otters thought to be mischievous? Oh, well, yes, otters are known to be quite mischievous. But here at the center, we love them. Did you know that they're listed as protected species? So here at the center, we make sure they thrive and survive. Wait, wait, wait. So what you're saying is each and every one of us otter do our part to protect them? me, Clyde, for this next part of the tour. Anything for you, Dr. Zootopia. It's a lofus. That's what I said. Okay. Here at the center, we have been studying the food sources and the eating behaviors of the animals here in our care. This allows us to understand and help sustain wild populations. For this next part, I will need help from a young volunteer. You had your hand right up. Come on down. Hello. What's your name? Harper, where are you from? Ah. All the way from America! Oh, hi, Harper. Come on over here. Now, you look like you want to feed my buddy Clyde, right? Of course you do. That's why you volunteered. I'm going to have you stand right here because he's going to come out any minute now. And this is packed with all the nutrients that he needs. Have you ever fed a sea lion before? No? This will be your first time. So this is going to be a cake when we're going to get in. And you said you're from America. What part of America are you from? Around here. So you're from Florida. Good to know. So you probably have a fantasy lion. So this is Clyde. And you're going to take it just like this. And you're going to do a big toss for me. Excellent job. Let's go one more because you are catching on pretty fast. Excellent job, Barbara. Right. Come over here. We're going to get a picture because you were amazing. And he's gonna come up here, and he's gonna pose for us, and you're gonna come right here. Put your hand on that flipper. Take a look at everyone. And on, oh, that's a big yawn. On the uh, count of three, we are gonna yell sardines real loud. One, two, three, sardines! Excellent job, you guys. Give it up for my youngest trainer. I bet that's Clyde, right? Yes, Neutron, very observant. And it's Dr. Zalophus. That's what I said. Ugh, never mind. We have already started the day and we have yet to start testing your pinniped knowledge. So question number one, how tall would you say sea lions are? Well, looking at him, I'd say three, maybe four feet tops. Check again. Check again. Huge. Well, yes, sea lions can actually grow up to nine feet in length. Oh, My wow. favorite fun fact is they actually have three tiny toenails and those rear flippers to get those hard to reach spots. Fine, you have toenails either, I can see them. Okay. Oh, I can see them. Oh, I can smell that in too, bud. Well, Clyde is showing he was a very social animal. We found they have their own personalities, likes, and dislikes. He really seems to like hanging out with me. Oh, you guys are adorable. He's also been very motivated in interacting with us and participating in his own health care. If you don't mind, I'm going to take him to go find Seymour. Why don't you help yourself to a complimentary refreshment? Wow, thanks, Dr. Xerox. Copy that. I am pretty thirsty, so drink sounds amazing right now. In these um, Neutron, your break's over. Uh oh, the can. Powerful 
front flippers up and down like a bird to gain speed. Show everyone how fast you can swim. Okay, round of applause for Seymour. Yeah. That was the best demonstration I have seen all day. So why don't you take this protein snack and head back this way. Um, Neutron, I have that second question for you. Yeah, what is it, Dr. Zaxby's? It's a low face. That's what I said. <laughs> question number two, uh, how fast would you say sea lions swim? Ooh, I got this. Uh, yeah. Tinson, Tinson, Tinson! No. What I meant was why don't you see if Clyde can demonstrate how fast he can swim. Why didn't you say that earlier? Okay, fine. Why don't you go into the water just like Seymour did? And I need you to use those really powerful pectoral muscles and swim. Wait, what is that? No, John! Okay! That's not quite what I had in mind. It's not what I had in mind either, you know? But it looks like Clyde got you there. It is your first day, so it's all right. I have an idea. Why don't you just lead this next part of the tour all by yourself? All by myself? Thanks, Dr. Zac Efron. I thought we were all in this together. <sighs> okay, Clyde, Doc still doesn't know that we lost the plan, so we need to look for it. So how about we go back to the basics? Do you remember when you were a pup and you used to mimic your mom's each and every move? Well, I'll be the mom, you be the pup. Follow me each and every move and stay close. Breathe out of that end. 
presentation, please exit to the back of the theater. And number three, if you need to number one or number two, restrooms are located outside of the center. <laughs> <laughs> 